Does your mama know you dance like that? Hi everybody, I'm BBXH here with Bren Chong today. We are at the B&B &B Gaming Studio and our past interviews we've kind of chatted about business and those topics, but today I want to ask you questions more about what you have learned. So my first question for you is what lessons can you share with our viewers? Oh, this for this 2019, uh, I, I learned that everything Everything has principles on certain things, and you gotta know them to know how to work your way through certain stuff. Mm -hmm. Okay, and if you know them and you follow them, it's like gravity. You know, if you jump, you're gonna fall. Mm -hmm. But that's basic because everybody knows it. But starting a business or hiring people, firing a friend because uh, there there are certain things that are hard to do but mm -hmm. you still must do it and they're the right way to do it okay okay the next thing I learned is okay there's so much good stuff and bad stuff happening in our life right yeah. and I think you got to be mindful with the bad stuff it's like eating if you're eating good stuff you don't need to take note of what you eat as long as it's good but if you eat uh, too much sugar too much uh, cholesterol mm -hmm. or, or bad stuff I mean you must be mindful that oh I eat like this I did this bad or everything one one good example I think is if in business decision mm -hmm. you're doing good decisions so you just know it's a good decision you, you, you let it there but if it's a bad decision because you hired the wrong people so you must be aware oh I did this I hired a bad uh, guy to do the work is mm -hmm. not fit for the job then you must correct that faster or you must correct the bad things that you know quick okay, okay. so that's just a secret I think okay and you've had some ups and downs I'm sure throughout business what have you learned from your struggles yeah because uh, at times you wouldn't know the right principles here, right? Because if you know, then you 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 you're probably wise and you learn mm -hmm. enough. But in our life, especially me, and if you the viewers are also young people, they probably first time in their life doing it. I mean, I heard someone who says, "Yeah, I may be fifty, but it's the first time I'm approaching this fifty, <laughs> so yeah. I'm a beginner at fifty-two. <laughs> I mean, some somebody says 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 things like that. Right? Yeah. So anyway. When you struggle, which I think all people will go through it, you just have to share the burden. Just gotta be someone who who have done that also, mm -hmm. or some friend that who who can help you, because they got the knowledge how to help you. So you just have to share them. You just have to talk to them. You know there are people where you you call if it's a good time, and there's a people you call when it's a bad time. Yeah. Make sure you know those people. Who you can call when it's when it's bad time and they're the one who can help you okay. you share you share to them then you learn mm -hmm. I think you have to be uh, scared also of the possibility of failure okay. I mean you have to be positive on things that you could do right, right. but doing it step by step a certain uh, philosophy of the warrior called Bushido mm -hmm. is the way of the warrior he always think that he could die so he will always act and move and and this and make a decision that danger is always present and I think if you apply this in your life that there there is danger if you made the wrong decision I think you would become wiser in your progress of how you progress on stuff how you how you learn stuff okay you said you and I were having a conversation yesterday and you said that success is a process and for me I just I don't know that really stood out to me so what advice could you give to the viewers who are struggling with success actually everything has an explanation everything is cause and effect everything is a cycle I mean if it's day comes night so if the market is good then later it will be overpriced <laughs> and then it, the market will goes down and it will come cheap and then the people can buy into it again so 
what's important is you understand your surroundings your stuff you understand the system so so if you understand it you're not afraid uh, I remember if you talking to someone and they said we're already uh, spending this much I mean how could how is it possible that you're not yet panicked mm -hmm. and I said because you didn't know the plan mm -hmm. but I saw the plan and the plan is that's the process mm -hmm. I understand that's the process and that's I understand that we have to spend this to develop this architecture or platform then we're gonna spend more to get mm -hmm. user base then after that it's in the plan where you 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 go ahead and and make profit make sales after it so that really depends on if you understand why it's happening and why you're doing it and uh, as long as it's planned and you're you're not surprised so you'll be comfortable because it was it was written it was talked about mm -hmm. so always follow the plan okay and what are some important keys to success well the obviously the plan right right you have to have a good plan good people mm -hmm. but you have to have uh, commitment and consistency commitment because sometimes things will go bad mm -hmm. you just have to stay committed and sometimes the answer you don't know yet but it will pop out just be committed and consistency because uh, if you have those two commitment and consistency then everything you do you would do it successfully okay even if you're researching committed commitment consistency you'll research it if you're building something if it's really big step by step by commitment by consistency you will finish it okay all right well anything else that you'd like to tack on to that we didn't cover well stay healthy and sleep uh, sleep long <laughs> that's important and of course you do you do networks talk to good people and you always uh, watch how people think how people do what how they act sometimes i ask young kids and and they ask me they ask me how would you know if i'm on the right track i mean mm -hmm. there's so much people who say one thing and do other things mm -hmm. and i said that's the point because <laughs> because if you're a new place or traveling you see a lot of people and you have to really be mindful of how they talk how they act and who they're friends with and how their friends talk and act because those probably those those are the real them the real the real mm -hmm. them they can't hide it if it's them they it, it will show so as you go on with your life as you as you as you meet people meet new people nowadays with with technology you meet people you have to be mindful of what's they what are they thinking what are they doing and who are they uh, friends with then you can evaluate if there's they're good people or they're not yet good people because <laughs> someday they probably adjust okay well thank you so much for sharing guys thanks for tuning in if you missed our other interviews be sure to check those out i'm bbxh this is bren chong and we'll see you guys next okay, time bye bye but does your mama know you dance like that